today you will study about using the relationship between multiplication and division to find the quotient. Say we have the first number, the second number, and the third number. Here, my first number is 2. And my second number is 5. My third number is 10. 2 or the first number times the second number equals the third number. 2 times 5 equals 10. And then, here, you could see third number. So, this is the third number. Third number divided by the first number equals the second number. So, here it is now. 10 divided by 2 equals 5. So, we could see now the relationship between multiplication and division. Another. Here, the third number divided by the second number equals the first number. Let us see. Our third number is 10. Divided by the second number is 5. Is equal to the first number, which is 2. 10 divided by 5 equals 2. It's correct. Another example, we will have bigger numbers like this. So, the first is multiplication and equal sign here. Say we have the first number is equal to 200. The second number is 7. And the third number is 1,400. So, we have 200 times 7 equals 1,400. Now, let us do this relationship. This is multiplication. This is division here. It says third number. This 1,400 divided by the first number. So, this is the first number, 200, equals the second number, 7. So, 1,400 divided by 200 equals 7. That's the relationship between multiplication and division to find the quotient. Now, I will ask you to answer your books, pages 23 and 24. Student book, Pratom 4B. Okay, bye.